What's well, up, y'all? It's your goddess Nani99, and welcome to another abundant feel episode of Life of Nani99. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the realest of them all? See them blessings, yeah, they fall, let it rain up on them. So in today's video, I told y'all that I was going to have like a segment, this surprise segment, you know, that I wanted to do for y'all, but that was months ago and now it's finally in the works. So this um, video, as you guys can see by the title, I'm going to be doing in uh, Come With Me as an Atlanta hookah girl to my interview. Went to an interview a few days ago and I'm going to this interview. I got the job to the last interview that I did a few days ago, but um they're like remodeling so now i'm just gonna show you guys uh they're remodeling so since they're remodeling we're not gonna be able to work until they open and i'm trying to work like yesterday so um i'm gonna be going to a lounge right probably like 20 minutes away from me i could still want to show you guys how like the interviews go like the vibes and everything i already got dressed this is like something that i would wear to like a nightlife interviews like still the slacks and everything like that but it's like you know a little bit more spicy a little bit more nightlife then of course i just did my lashes nails i could show you guys maintenance like and stuff like that later right now i gotta go print off my resume it's from two to six it's like 150 something right now you always want to be early to an interview but you don't want to be like the first person so that's what we're gonna get ready to go do right now um yeah i'm gonna just take y'all with me that's just gonna be that and i think these pants are so cute i got these from akira i'm gonna show y'all when i stand up how i got uh, where i got them this i actually got from a thrift store like two years ago this right here was from when i used to work at another lounge and i just really like how it looks like together with the beads and the black and white like it makes me look like i'm doing something you know <laughs> without further ado let's get right into it so we're here and I got the job. Now I'm just showing them that I know how to make a hookah. Making the hookah right now, you know, doing the preparations and everything. It's kind of like a taste test. They want to see. How you doing? I just want to prepare the hookah. I'm still waiting on the coals in here. It's taking up a little while. I don't really like that, but it's cool. Everything like that. The club is so cute. I really love the vibe. This club um, is like only open two days a week. So that's a good thing. Because I can work at the other place, so you know, every it's like all vibes. They said they like my vibe, they like my energy, and everything like that. They'll, you know, be happy for me to work here, and I'm excited to work here too, to be honest. I don't want to get copyrighted, so I'm gonna talk to y'all a little bit later. Hey, yo, y'all saying they lingerie on that shot, and they's going touchdowns on your runway. I'm Texas forever, like, boy, I'm playing a Rambo in the yo. I'm building a rich like John Jack, I'm Camo in the yo. These thoughts can't talk me now, days. You wish I was no pound pig. Boy, you know I look good at for Wish I was no baby mom. Want me to go on? Oh, the cook wanted me to try his freaking waffles. These look so good. He was like, you better try my waffles. They are the Captain Crunch. Captain Crunch? Okay, these are Captain Crunch. I cannot wait to eat. I'm about to try it right now. One out of ten. One out of ten. I give them the eight. They good. The only reason why I would say eight is a little bit more fluffiness. So you need to add like some almond milk or something. Yeah. But these good. What's up, y'all? So it's the next sunrise. I've been up since like seven something but it's about like nine something right now i just realized that i didn't close the other the video out from the interview and everything like that it went so good like everything was so good the people were cool it was it's another hoop girl that got hired with me it's gonna be me and her so as far as like the pay at this club it's a little bit different they kind of have it like a base pay plus tips which i don't mind because regardless even if like there's like two tables we still get paid the same amount including tips so i kind of like that because the other clubs that i've been to either it will be like kind of like a fin for yourself like it's just tips for good girls or it'll be a thing where oh you get like commission i like commission as well i like commission and base but i really like commission because i can see my money piling up but with base pay i for sure know that I'm not going driving all the way to work for no reason. No, every day, it doesn't matter. So I like that as well. As far as like the experience with this club that was kind of different from other the other clubs is that, well, there's not really much different. So with, okay, so if you've never like done like a hookah audition or a server audition or a bottle service audition, basically most of the clubs, if they like you, they'll hire you on the spot. If they don't like you, 
they're, they'll ask, like, they'll tell you to, they'll keep in contact, basically, if they need more space for people later on. I've had both experiences where they hired me on the spot, which is yesterday, and the other club that I'm going to be working at, too, once they're done renovating, I got hired on the spot for both of those clubs. There was one club that they told me that they would get back to me, um, you know, they would give, just look for a call back, and um, I haven't got a call back yet from them reasons being is because I asked for a hookah position because that's like mostly what I've done before and they were only looking for services and waitresses and I told them I could do that but you know it was on my application so yada 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 but I'm not tripping about that because this club that I'm at is very much vibes it's bigger this the aesthetic is so much cuter like you guys saw in the clips and on top of that I feel like it's more like I will be able to network better at this club more than it just being just about the money. Um, like as far as like the DJs, um, the owners, stuff like that. They're more open and like networky than the other club. So this was just like the vlog, you know, just showing you guys like live in action, like how the interview process works and everything like that. Um, I kind of did like a little bit of talk through, but if you guys want like a full sit down where I really explain like how to get hired at a hookah lounge or how to get hired at a club i can do that you guys just go ahead and like this video comment down below what do you, what do you guys want to see from me i'm gonna do a whole series of this so like it's definitely lit we definitely outside and i'm so excited to start this series with you guys without further ado go ahead and like comment and subscribe to join the space gang because i promise you it is so dope from here like 99 the nyne baby is the whole vibe is completely changed okay i love you guys and i'll see you guys in my next video Peace.